This is the 2014 Mazda 3, the third vehicle from Mazda to get a full suite of Skyactiv technology. It started out with the CX-5, then the Mazda 6, and now this. What does it mean? From the wheels up, a brand new vehicle. Platform, engine, transmission, and it all comes together to provide a more dynamic looking vehicle, greater handling, and better fuel efficiency. And the Mazda 3 represents over 50% of total sales for Mazda Canada. Within Canada, year to date, we've sold almost a half a million units, so it is a very important vehicle for Mazda. The sedan remains the uh, majority of our sales, however, we have a very strong mix for the hatchback. The hatchback represents over 30% of our mix to date. The first blush when you look in this Mazda 3, you can tell it's finished with some quality materials. First, the dash. It's not a soft touch dash, it's plush. It feels like soft underlay underneath the carpet, it's that soft. You see the large screen in the center of the dash, it's seven inches, and in between the seats is a controller. This is standard on the middle GS trim and above. Now they've designed the controller to be able to use it without actually having to look at it. They did all kinds of studies and they found that just putting your hand on it and having three switches above the controller instead of maybe four or five was the best way for people to memorize. The center one is for, I'm not even looking at it, the center one is the home screen, the left one is for music, and the right one is for navigation. And I've only been driving this car for a short period of time. So when the car is in motion, you cannot use the touch screen, you can only use it when the car is stopped. Now that forces the driver to pay attention to what's going on in front of them and you don't have to look down or fumble around with the screen settings. Now optional is a heads-up display. It's a little flip-up screen instead of projecting it onto the windshield. Mazda believes that the way they've set it up is it seems like the focal point is down actually on the hood and the way they do that is through mirrors underneath the dashboard. It is not the cleanest display. It's not perfectly clear but you also have to keep in mind this is not a $70,000 luxury car. It's an inexpensive compact vehicle. Now yes, there are still some dials and switches and they're mostly there for the heating system, which is fairly easy to use. One button I'm really particularly happy, or dial I should say, is the volume knob right next to the main center controller. This is borrowed from Audi and it's the way to go. Another thing you'll notice next to the controller, a proper handbrake. It's not a push brake on the floor or an electric one, it's actually a real handbrake. And you know what? That's something that's fading away and I'm glad to see it. The uh, 2014 Mazda 3, I'm happy to say, has the same price as the uh, 2013 model year, starting from $15,995 for our entry GX trim level. And of course, uh, we've added significant content to the GX trim, including the new 2.0 liter uh, Skyactiv G engine with 155 horsepower and 150 pounds of torque. Other features that are new to the GX are standard USB, standard Bluetooth, as well as push button start. We designed the 2014 Mazda 3 with safety in mind. We know that today's consumers are going to be using a lot of technologies in their car. Uh, our example are our iActive Sense features, including blind spot monitoring system, lane departure warning, including our IE loop regenerative braking system. This Mazda 3 was right at the top of its class in terms of handling and dynamics. Not bad for a car that was at the end of its life. For 2014, Mazda takes the same platform used in the highly successful Mazda CX-5 and modifies it to produce excellent results. The body and platform is lighter and stiffer, making the engine work less. This saves fuel. The steering is much crisper. In fact, the steering ratio is quicker than the MX-5 Miata. The front steering geometry has been adjusted for more bite on turn-in, helping to mitigate the common numbness found in most electric steering systems. The result is a car that is still at the top of its class. It dances in the corners, the suspension is connected without being too harsh, and the whole experience is very sure-footed.
Well, this new 2014 Mazda 3, in my opinion, sets a whole new standard for the compact class. Just look at the features that are available in this car. Heads-up display. I like the controller and the information screen. Really is class above. Fabulous looking interior, great driving dynamics, and two very fuel efficient Skyactiv engines. You get the sedan, you get the hatch, you get many different configurations to get just the car you want. If you're in the market for a compact car, this is a new standard. And if you're commuting and you want a little bit of fun in your drive, this is a great place to start. Want more? Extended reviews of many of our segments are available online at drivingtelevision.com.